is the energy vibration uh, reading for um, the Pisces cancer and scorpions I'm trying to get the light <laughs> I'm trying to get the evening light okay all right let's see a card came out Pisces please like share these videos all right past life something about the past life is in the reverse some of you Pisces are dealing with issues from past life okay and it came out in the reverse what is going on so what I'm seeing with the energy of past life it is always people who you have had a past life with who you have created a love with who um, past life always come up with people who you have had live together okay it's a sense of knowing um, the sense of reconnecting a feeling of knowing someone you know before um, the link and a journey together through memories and feeling a deja vu that is coming up for you Pisces this can lead to long-term relationship or just a brief reunion okay so don't expect much um, from a new person that you're going to be meeting in the month of October going into um, to complete a cycle or to move on okay so some of you are going to be meeting someone new and having this um, connection it's a deja vu connection but it is not something to last for a lifetime okay so some of you might be thinking oh my god I've met this person it feels as if it is something to last for a lifetime no it's a deja vu sometimes it just people just pop in to heal something and release it like heal a situation where you're in a relationship but you met someone and you feel the passion and um, the butterflies in your your stomach and then you just want to leave everything and drop everything behind and go for that person that person is going to do the same thing to you <laughs> so <laughs> that is what is coming up so that is your energy um, Pisces let's see what is coming up for the Pisces Sun Moon and Rising sign in love for the month of October Pisces all right chocolate brown men the chocolate brown men are here what is happening with you guys you are meeting um, a mature woman this is someone who is very professional have their own business and you want to have a re open relationship with this person okay so you chocolate brown woman uh, brown men chocolate brown men have meet someone in business this is a high-powered business woman and you want to have a, re a open relationship with this person <laughs> okay chocolate brown men whatever is happening destined it was destined to happen whatever is happening with your relationship chocolate brown men it was destined to happen you work in women there is karma working women and man you're having a karmatic relationship we're going to be looking where is that happening money seems to be um, the problem and I think that because of money issues some of you um, are going to be connecting with people that is financial stability that is just so wrong that is like you're being a, a prostitute I'm sorry just control issues you chocolate brown men have some control issues you got to work on your control issues chocolate brown men or someone could be controlling you chocolate Ooh, passion <laughs> oh my okay so work people are having some passion it could be on the work floor it's not gonna last <laughs> Okay, true gem is coming up. Oh my god! Oh my god! Okay, all right. I, I just uh, uh, listen. Gift a true gift is going to be coming in for you, chocolate brown men. Uh, you chocolate brown men is going to create a baby. It's it's all about the baby. Some of you are going to be given expensive gift, but it's all about the baby. Dating queens or out. Ooh, and these people who are dating, there's a lot of passion. Hmm. Okay, family is here. There's some issue with family, and some of you, if you're deciding to leave your family, it's wrong. Soulmate are coming up. So some of you chocolate brown men are going to be reconnecting with your soulmate. Okay, and I'm seeing you like giving them a lot of gifts. So. And, and especially people between the ages of 18 and 25 you're going to be um, 
you're, you're definitely going to be connecting you're going to be dating a lot and you're going to be meeting your soul fail so if you are um, between 18 and 25 there's a lot of gossip there's a lot of gossip okay let me tell you where the gossip is okay now at the work floor the people who are having relationship or um, having feelings for people on the work floor and this is it Pisces I always tell people it is wrong to do these things on the work floor you end up either losing your job or it is very uncomfortable okay and whenever people partner found out that you're dealing with someone on the work floor that is when they embarrass you at your work so um, you Pisces you got to be aware of what you're doing because this is coming up and a lot of gossip is going to come up especially the Pisces who are married I'm seeing a lot of gossip but um, because you're having a relationship or people realize that there is some um, attraction between you and someone else on the work floor and um, you know what is going to happen is that your partner is going to find out and there is going to be some embarrassing situation for you guys okay or you women okay the middle and the center passion is coming up free yourself okay so whoever is in a, a work relationship is either you end that relationship or you're free yourself from the relationship that you're in because it's it, it's not looking that good Pisces it's not looking that good okay I'm telling you passion is here so I'm seeing a lot of people are getting involved with other people because of money Pisces that's so bad and you know I love you Pisces but it's kind of bad but it's not my thing you gotta know you gotta do what you gotta do Pisces but it, that's not nice it's not nice deceptiveness okay all right so whatever is happening there is some deceptiveness that is playing out by you chocolate brown men now you chocolate brown men are only connecting with someone on the work floor or someone you're doing business with because you need something from them you have known them in past lifetime it is a karmic situation you are destined to meet this person but you're deceptively using them for something there is no love there's nothing here so we all know that true love is coming up true love is coming up this is the romance of a lifetime okay so um mm, mm, mm. some of you are dealing with a chocolate brown man and you think wow this is so good i've never had it before it's just sex ladies and gentlemen you know it's like smoking a cigarette after the cigarette is hot you know that's it it's just sex okay people like sex honeymoon <coughs> <laughs> all right I'm seeing some of you Pisces traveling abroad and some of you Pisces are lying to your partners and they're going to know I'm seeing you going on business trips but you're actually having sexually um, connection with people and you know this is kind of sad okay I'm telling you something Pisces stop this shit because you're going to be fined out all right just very soon <laughs> oh my god very very soon okay some of you who are looking especially the singles who are looking for new love new love is coming in and this is coming in very very soon true love and new love is coming in and this is going to be coming in very very soon okay I'm seeing some of you traveling and going on business trip and on the business trip you are having sexual connection um, with people it's either you're meeting them there or either it's either you're meeting them there you know listen Pisces this is a karmatic time in the 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 the, the, the universe this is a karmatic time um, and, and 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 you know Pisces you kind of have sex with someone um, by talking to them before even touching them some of you need to control yourselves okay because I'm seeing you people getting in some serious problem 
whoever goes on a business trip and have sexual intimacy relationship it's going to be found out not only by your partner but by your work and you're going to lose your work choose between your work and a sexual relationship that you think that someone is not going to find about out about okay playfulness is here so i'm seeing a lot of you are really um flirting playfulness recapturing romance which is good with your partner that is very very good i am seeing you buying nice gifts and uh, allowing your inner uh, youth spirit of fun is coming out i'm seeing you really connecting with um your partner and this is just going to be very beautiful i'm seeing um, you know, if you're married to someone, I'm seeing you going out on dates or you're carrying on flowers. Some of you need to call in your soulmate, especially you singles. You, some of you singles want to have a child. Uh, you're ready for a family and you need to just call in your soulmate. Okay. Call in your soulmate. Cause I'm seeing some of you singles really is ready to have um, a family. Stay optimistic about your love life. So I'm seeing some of you in soulmate relationship, especially the people between the age of 25 and 18 and 25. And you are dating people and you know, you're really looking for this right person. Some of you are going to be finding your twin flame and soulmate. This is going to be beautiful. I'm seeing a connection coming up here, which is just so beautiful. And that is it. It's just so wonderful so beautiful that is coming up so i'm seeing a lot of you pisces could be meeting your soulmate i'm seeing a lot of passion because i'm seeing a lot of you pisces are thinking about having open relationships and why is that some of you pisces especially business people people in um professional business i'm seeing that you met someone on the work floor and you're thinking that this is true love but it's only because the person is financial stable that's kind of wicked whatever it's your thing I don't have to deal with God with that shit you know your own your own intu intuition is going to be dealing with you now chocolate brown men you're being very deceptive with um, someone who came in your life as a true love you're being very 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 deceptive you chocolate brown men okay especially the ones that travel on business and go overseas deceptiveness you're seeing other people lying false relationship you have the mask up now we have destiny some of you were destined for this passion some of you are going to be calling in especially the singles are going to be calling in their soulmate and their soulmate is going to come in you're going to be ending up having kids with this person some of you are being held on a string some of you are are dating other people there's gossip because people know what you're doing and you think that um people don't know what you do it and i'm thinking that the people who are doing this it's as if the universe is going to make your partner know what you're doing because you think you are smart and that you are pulling off everything but the universe is going to fuck you up and fuck you up good like i'm seeing <laughs> I'm sorry I'm seeing a lot of people that um, you know have this high profession job or finally get a good um, um, profession you're stepping up the ladder and the people who were there when you had nothing you're kind of stepping on them going up the ladder but guess what you're gonna fall off that ladder and you're gonna be falling back because and the person who you're going to be leaving at the bottom where you two have been struggling through it is the same person who is going to get up the ladder and that person is going to stay. That person is not going to fall off that ladder. That person is going to stay. Have optimism um, in your relationship. Okay, chocolate brown men. I'm seeing that you have to, you're going to be find out what unexpectedly your partner is going to be finding out that you're deceptive. I'm sorry. Again, um, some of you business women who are in relationship with someone who keeps on telling you, oh, you're my true love, you're my true love. You are going to cut the BS and realize that this person is just lying, just plain lying. Oh! A tower moment came down with a open relationship. So some of you um, were in an open relationship and whatever happened, your, your partner f found out about this open relationship bam <laughs> sorry 
um, men between the age of 18 and 45 um, you're uh, some of you are being very deceptive and you're going to be meeting someone because you're in um, a passionate you could be meeting someone abroad and you end up in a passionate relationship but um, yeah <laughs> okay it's gonna be coming out it's gonna be coming out your partner is going to find out about it it's definitely going to be coming out so whoever you are if you're between the age of um, um, 25 or 45 you are going you're, who, and you're traveling abroad every time you're traveling abroad your partner is going to find out is that a someone is going to take a picture and send to your partner someone is going to see and know that you're lying and it's it's coming to an end okay some of you um let it go you know it's not nice i love you guys so much but don't stay in a relationship for the money okay it's going to come to an end don't stay in a relationship for money i see that some of you are being um either manipulated through negative energies or so and it has to do with an aries leo or sagittarius an aries leo or sagittarius is manipulating you either via love spell or they have you on a, as a puppet okay some of you are having passionate relationship with an older man it is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn some of you are going to be calling in your um, soulmate and you're going to be meeting a, a love someone who's really really honest and really it's, it's, it's as if some of you are calling up your soulmate to come in and this is someone from a past lifetime okay and this person is going to be coming in very very soon okay some of you unexpectedly your relationship is going to be healed let's say that you are in a relationship and there's so many ups and downs there's so many situations so many things that is happening stay optimistic about your relationship especially the people who are in soulmate relationship twin flame relationship stay optimistic about your relationship and stop with the um, dating and that sort of a thing because your relationship is going to be ill it's just going through a situation some of you need to call up on your soulmate tell the universe you're ready for your soulmate to come in some of you are having issues with a scorpion um some of you your soulmate is a scorpion and you're having issues with this person there's heartaches there's heartaches there's news that you're going to be finding out about a scorpion okay you could have been seeing the scorpion the scorpion um, could be you could have had a relationship with a scorpion in a relationship with a scorpion but whatever is happening it's you, you know it's gonna be coming out some of you who are dealing with um, a chocolate chocolate man or woman this person could be an Aquarius Gemini or Libra and they're very deceptive very deceptive some of you mature business people you are dealing with someone and their partner is going to be finding out and 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 ending this love affair okay so whoever you are you could be dealing with an aquarian this could be your wife or your partner whoever this person is she's going to find out about the other person and she's going to end it you know I wouldn't end it I would just let it go I would just say mother effer move on because it's not gonna last trust me ladies and gentlemen when you deal with that when you find out that your partner is um, is lying and deceiving you let them go call upon the universe to cut the hard string let them go because guess what the same thing they do to you is the same thing somebody else is gonna do to them so let it go let it go let it go um and, and there again I'm saying with um, there is lack of communication with a relationship some of you there is lack of relationship with um, um, lack of communication with your relationship but don't give up on it because especially if you're in a soulmate relationship because you know when you 
are in a relationship with your soulmate see good news is going to be coming in good news your relationship is really going to be ill don't give up on your relationship for the people who are in soulmate relationship there are ups and downs in all relationship okay now there's a lot of gossip because whatever is transpiring I'm seeing a lot of gossip is going on here a lot of gossip and um, the gossip is coming from people who are having relationship of the work floor because some of you Pisces are having um, attraction to people of the work floor and other people are seeing it and is gossiping about this there is some of you that someone get fired because of some connection or whatever attraction that you showed to this person and they're going to be blaming you Pisces that is that you come across sexually harassing to them so yeah and, and this is what I say to people people need to hold there you need to know when um, when you're in a professional position you know up the work floor if you work for a company you need to understand that I need to represent myself as very professional uh, it doesn't matter who it doesn't matter if there is any attractment or whatever if it was meant to be whatever you or the other person leave that job 20, 20 years from now and you reconnect when uh, you guys are not working in the same company that is when it happened but some of you are going to be getting the blame some of you are going to be blamed that because of you they're going to be saying that the way you look at them or the way you communicate with them or how you show or how um, the you know or, or you have said something to them that went over they're gonna blame you for it so I'm seeing a lot of you coming in um, especially professional people whatever has transpired there is some gossip on the work floor so you know if you were seeing someone on the work floor it's just my advice you gotta choose your professional life or the work or, or the the fling or the flirt of whatever you have with a person on the work floor because guess what you Pisces because you are in love and in love uh, and and that's all that is happening but if you're in a relationship with a water sign an air sign um, they're going to let you down on the work floor okay because there is a lot of gossip um, and there is a Virgo on the work floor that is seeing everything that is happening and they're gossiping over you they are seeing how you look how you react and, and they're gossiping over you they could be even making up stories so whatever it is I love you guys I'm seeing some of you could be connecting with um, the um, this is Leo's especially you young people I love you guys I gotta go namaste